Hi guys, welcome back to another video for a Christmas collection. This time we're talking about my Christmas collection. This is the Moonshine Manny Christmas collection that launches this Friday, December 14th. As you may have figured out from the title of this video, this is going to be a long video. So we better go ahead and get into it. This collection has 12 polishes. That's really not usual for my brand. I usually stick to around six polish collections. Let me tell you really quickly how this collection was born. I love giveaways. I love a Christmas giveaway. And when I was conceiving this year's 12 days of Christmas giveaway, I decided I want to give away one polish for each of the 12 days of Christmas. And I wanted to give away a new polish. And so the 12 days of Christmas movies collection was born because I decided if I was going to give away these polishes to just 12 members of the group, that wouldn't really be fair. The members who are winning these polishes are getting them ahead of time of everybody else. So they're getting an exclusive advance look at the polishes. Well, and they're getting them for free. Um, but I decided to make the collection available to everyone on Friday. The members of the group who are winning these polishes polishes are gradually winning more and more polishes because each day that winner gets that polish and all the polishes that came before kind of like on the first day of Christmas song where you first just have the partridge in the pear tree and then the next day you have two French hens and the partridge in the pear tree. That's how the giveaway has been going. So our final winner, which will be announced tomorrow, today was the last day to enter the giveaway if you want to go enter. Um, but tomorrow when the winner is announced, that person will be receiving all 12 polishes in this collection. So that's why this collection is so big because I just, Sometimes when I get a theme in my mind, I just have to go with it. And it just so happened that this theme was really, really big. So instead of just the 12 days of Christmas, I did the 12 days of Christmas movies because you guys know I love movies, TV, pop culture, music, all that kind of stuff. And so I picked 12 of my favorite Christmas or holiday movies and inspired a polish after each. We will be going in alphabetical order, just as the same order that the giveaway has been happening. So the first polish we're going to talk about, every person in the giveaway received this polish. And then we're going to swatch through everything just like I always do on my channel so you can see how things apply. And then I'll be showing you my photo at the end. So we're going to go ahead and get started because like I said, if we don't, we're going to be here forever. Okay, so the first polish in the collection happens to be Tim's pick. Tim is my husband. He does help me a lot behind the scenes with Moonshine Manny and often is the person behind the naming of a lot of polishes. Not all the time, but you know a small percentage of polishes he names. This is the holiday movie that he wanted to appear in this collection. So we're talking about Die Hard. So Die Hard definitely does happen at Christmas time. Some of these movies are going to be a lot more like they happen at Christmas time and less Christmas themed movies. So like this movie, for example, it's, is it Christmas Eve or Christmas Day? I'm not super familiar with it as Tim is, but I know it's a Bruce Willis film. I know I've seen it a few times. This polish is super duper sparkly and I was really excited that it came first alphabetically. I didn't plan it that way, but it just kind of happened that way because that meant everyone got this super bright sparkly jelly bomb polish. So I describe Die Hard as a black jelly bomb packed with a rainbow of iridescent glitters and it also has silver hollow and it has fuchsia to green aurora shimmer. So as you roll this polish or as you move your nail in the light you're going to be seeing a strong pink from some angles or it's more of a fuchsia really to a beautiful bright emerald green. This polish is so, so fun, you guys. A lot of glitter, if you're unfamiliar with my jelly bombs, basically it's like a glitter bomb, but it's in a jelly base so that you're still getting a nice amount of pigment there, but it's just absolutely packed with glitter. The next polish in the collection is for one of my favorite holiday movies ever. And this is for the movie Elf. And I did my whole Christmas collection my very first year in business, 2016 Christmas after the film Elf. This time the polish is just named Elf because each of the polishes are just the title of the movie. I thought about doing quotes from each film but I decided to just keep it more simple so you knew exactly what movie was inspiring the polish. This polish is a Rainforest Cream Green. So this is a cream polish but it is infused with a bright 
Aurora Shimmer that is reminiscent of Unicorn Pea in that it's going from bright red to green. This pigment is a little bit larger, almost going towards a micro flaky. If you get in there with a magnifying glass, it's going to kind of look like a micro flaky. So anyway, I really, really love this polish. I wanted it to be green. I want it to be jolly, just like Buddy the Elf. I have another jelly bomb for you here, you guys. This is actually an orange polish. The components of this polish are orange, gold, copper, and fuchsia. I really love how orange and like a fuchsia pink to purple look together. So that's what I created for this collection. So not necessarily a traditional Christmas coloration. In fact, there's only maybe three or four that necessarily look very Christmassy. Almost everything in this collection can transition throughout your year and you won't have to pack them away after the Christmas season is over. I did that on purpose because I was launching this collection after the 12 days of Christmas giveaway was over. I purposefully am launching this in December, right before Christmas happens, because I wanted to have the giveaway first so I realized that you don't have a lot of time to wear these before Christmas, and so only a few of them look super, super Christmassy. So this polish is called Four Christmases. So definitely a Christmas movie. If you don't know, this movie is Reese Witherspoon and Vince Vaughn, who are hilarious together. And basically, they each have two different homes to go to for Christmas because both of their parents have been divorced so that's why they have four Christmases and they usually don't go to their family holiday get-togethers but they do end up having to go to them and they're all a catastrophe and it's just a big crazy experience that will either make or break their relationship who knows what's gonna happen okay we're gonna go in the complete opposite direction because this next polish is my first matte polish so this polish without taco is going to be this soft azure blue matte shade but it's also filled with aurora shimmer to give it a little something extra when you look close so this polish is home alone quintessential happy family holiday movie we just watched it the other night with my kids if you don't know the storyline of home alone i bet you all do but if you don't you should watch it <laughs> a kid's left home at christmas and some bandits try to come and steal his family's possessions and he's there home alone to guard the house and if you think about it it's actually kind of scary and lots of times I kept wondering to myself why this kid wasn't calling the police but in any case it is one of my family's favorite holiday films and this polish is just called home alone I'm gonna do two coats today the description reads matte azure blue cream infused with fuchsia to green aurora shimmer so it's the same aurora shimmer that's in die hard and I note that if you wear it without top coat, it'll be matte. And if you add some top coat, you will probably see that shimmer even more on your nail. So this next polish is Tim's actual favorite Christmas movie, but I'd already chosen this film to be in this collection. And so he was adding Die Hard as his extra polish that I hadn't thought of for Christmas. But this is his actual favorite Christmas movie and that's It's a Wonderful Life. So this polish is a micro glitter in a jelly base. As you can see, it's this bright cobalt blue, and that's also the shade of the glitter in this polish. It's a cobalt blue holographic glitter. And I've also added in a more scattered manner, so it's just kind of accenting the blue, some gold hollow and some iridescent orange hollow, which just makes it which just makes a really nice complementary color to that blue and a really beautiful pop of color. So my official description of this polish is cobalt blue jelly filled with cobalt holographic micro glitters. As this is a micro glitter, I'm gonna take my time building it up. I'm gonna do three coats. Because it's in that jelly base, it looks so squishy, you guys. It's really, really cool. If you do nice thin coats and do all of those three coats, you're kind of forming this jelly sandwich for yourself that looks just deep and beautiful, almost like the night sky, but it's brighter. All right, so if you know me, you know that I love purple, and you will soon see after I start swatching this polish that this is basically the heart of the collection because it's purple, it's flaky, it's shimmering, and it's just kind of 
all the things I love. Of course, I wanted to play with lots of different colors, finishes and formulas, and giving something for everybody here, but this is the one that if the, if I was watching somebody else's collection and I didn't already know what colors were coming up, I'd be like, whoa, okay, this was the one that was made for me. Okay, this is Love Actually, and I really, really, really love this Christmas film. I feel like this would be very family friendly if they just took out the one storyline. Well, maybe two storylines, but you probably know what I'm talking about. But I just really like this film. It shows, it's not of course exactly like true life, but it shows some happy stories and some hard stories. And I just find it to be a lot of fun and it always makes me feel very joyful. I cry at the end like every single time no matter what. I think I cried through a lot of the film. So anyway, Love Actually is an indigo jelly glowing with red to green Aurora Shimmer and filled with copper hollow, red to green iridescent glitter, and violet to red to orange, and pink to purple to blue iridescent flakies. So <laughs> I just kind of put all the things I love in here, like I was saying before. Okay, you've made it through half of the collection. <laughs> Let's keep on going. This is the polish that is decidedly Christmas looking and probably the only one that you would point out and say, okay, that's a Christmas polish. This polish actually came to life one time many months ago when Honor and I were making polish. And she created this lovely composition of red and green glitters. And when I saw her pull those out together, I thought, well, this will be fun. Let's see what she creates for Christmas. And so I helped her design this base color, which is a light kind of bleached out spring yellow green. So I named this polish The Grinch because the new Grinch came, film came out, but the, I haven't even seen it yet. So the film I'm referencing truly with this polish is the original classic, The Grinch Who Stole Christmas. But I decided to just name it The Grinch because it was gonna fit better on my label. This next polish is definitely another one of my favorites. I have been wearing this on my toes for months and I'm so in love with it, you guys. So this is a multi-chrome that is also a holographic. This polish is inspired by the film The Holiday. This polish, I was experimenting with a different kind of hollow than I usually use. It's a micro hollow flaky, and I packed so much of it into this polish that it looks like a linear holographic base. You're also going to be seeing some larger flakies and those are silver platinum flakies. So those two things, the hollow and the silver platinum flake, you're combining to give it this very brilliant like diamond shimmer on the nail. But then the pigment in this polish is a gorgeous shifting multi-chrome shimmer and it's going from gold to copper to red. And I just love this polish. It is the one that I've had on my nails in this video. And like I said, I've been wearing it on my toes for months. I just keep reapplying it and it just makes me so happy every time I look down at my nails. This next polish is a sister to love actually. It's a little bit different, but it uses a lot of the same components. This time we have this kind of midnight blue that's been dusted way out. And this is the Polar Express. So this polish is different than Love Actually in that it is a crowley instead of a jelly. So it's going to reach opacity a little bit faster. I describe it as a soft midnight blue crowley glowing with pink to blue Aurora shimmer. So it has a different shimmer than Love Actually as well. Giving the glow a roll through pink, violet, and blue. And I filled it with copper hollow, red to green iridescent glitter, and violet red orange and pink purple blue iridescent flakies. So it does have those same components, basically making a beautiful rainbow in this bottle, just like Love Actually. I really feel that it's kind of magical and the copper hollow against the blue base is really, really fun. We have reached the second micro glitter in the collection and this is the red polish in the collection. I wanted to put a Christmas red in this year and I wanted it to be a micro glitter, but it's not super ultra traditional Christmas red because it's actually a mix of red and black glitters. This polish is called The Santa Claus. I have seen this film so many times I've lost count. It's a classic Tim Allen film where he and his son go to the North Pole and Tim Allen becomes Santa Claus. Spoiler, but you find that out in like the first 10 minutes, so. If you haven't seen it, I highly recommend it. Again, this is another one we watch with our kids at least once a year. So the Santa Claus is described as a red and black hollow micro glitter accented with red to gold micro flickies and red to copper to gold 
multi-chrome flakies. So this is very different from the other micro glitter. It's packed with a lot more things, but it doesn't have a colored base. So you don't have any pigment in the base building up opacity for you on your nail. You're building it all up with the glitters and the flakies. So this next polish is inspired by While You Were Sleeping. I love this film so much, and while I don't necessarily think of it as a Christmas movie, it does take place over Christmas. So this polish is another cream, but again, it is filled with shimmer. This time we have a multi-chrome shimmer. When I look at this polish, I see a smoky plum, but actually the components that I use to make in this, I use quite a bit of green in this base. I added green and red, which basically make brown. I added black and white to make it this beautiful smoky shade and then the purple actually comes from the multi-chrome pigment that I added. So the multi-chrome pigment shifts between this yummy plummy kind of almost fuchsia shade and then it rolls through like a gold and a green on the edges. In this polish because it's a cream and I didn't sheer it out like a jelly, the multi-chrome shimmer shift is a lot more subtle. You do definitely see it there, which you'll especially see in some of my photos in indirect lighting. Okay, so this last polish, have you guessed what it's gonna be? Because we were just at the word while. So what could this polish be? Aside from Honor's Grinch polish, which was created months and months and months ago, this is the first polish I created when I decided I was going to do a 12 Days of Christmas collection. This is the first one. This is a white curly filled with gold hollow, and then it's accented with red and green shimmer. It's a very subtle shimmer, but I wanted to add it because that's what made it Christmassy. And like I mentioned, it is a white curly with gold hollow. It's a whole bunch of different kinds of gold hollow glitters. There are squares, there are micro glitters, there are hex glitters, and I definitely don't feel like Christmas colors have to be red and green. Gold is something that I always think of with Christmas, which is why I used it so heavily in the holiday. So that's why I made this polish like it is, and I feel like it's really, really fun and sparkly and a really different way to do a Christmas crelly. It's kind of like a secret Christmas crelly. <laughs> and that is a whole collection. Sorry you guys, I told you this was going to be a long video. I'll be doing my best to edit this down to keep it as concise as possible. You know I always have a hard time with that with my collections because I want to tell you all about why I did what. Actually, if you get this whole collection, you're getting it at a 15% discount. All 12 polishes for $112, where each individual polish is normally $11 on my website. So that gives you almost two polishes for free if you get the whole thing. But the bundling option makes it so you can get 10% off both at a three count bundle and a six count bundle. So you're getting savings even if each of these polishes isn't your cup of tea. And that function on my website also makes it so you can pull things in from many different collections and still get a good discount bundle price point. So those are there for you in case this feels overwhelming. <laughs> I do have the bundling option available. There's a little drop down box and you just go and like check which polishes you want to get. So again, these will be available on Friday. My collections always launch at 9 a.m. Eastern or 6 a.m. Pacific Standard Time. That is the whole swatch video. I hope that you found it helpful. I hope that you enjoy hearing why I did what I did. I just love explaining my decisions to you guys. It's like half of the fun telling you why I did it. So anyway, you guys, thanks for being here for this video. I hope that you enjoyed it. Let me know down below what you thought. Did I leave out your favorite Christmas film? Ah, oh, I'm sorry if I did, but there's always next time. And our Facebook exclusive is actually gonna be named after a line in another Christmas film that didn't appear in this collection. All right, I'm gonna wrap it up like I said I would, you guys. Thanks for being here today. I will see you back for the next video very soon and take care until then. Bye.